that you had raised, the first thought figure with you, first your immediate reaction to what has transpired in court today? Well, this is MPP. The founders of our tradition use the court to do full right. And true to it, we are Democrats. We don't believe in violence. We don't believe in mischief and unnecessary political chaos. We came to court believing that the court will do right. And indeed, the court has just done that. The rights of those MPs have been reinforced as well as the rights of those constituents who elected them. I will leave the Ghanaian public to peruse the full ruling of the court and then the discussions can continue. But let me thank the, my colleagues in leadership, uh, especially the hardworking majority chief whip for all the support and his industry. I thank senior members of parliament, Uncle Joe Gatti, Honorable Kennedy Japan, not the least Uncle Katie Hammond, and others who have been supporting me. Again, equally important are my colleagues in the backbench, especially those who lost their primaries. They've been with us thick and thin. The whole of last night we didn't sleep. We've been working all night. I myself, being a practitioner of, of our courts, made sure we put together a solid case. And this afternoon, we've had justice. Now, those NDC people who are, you know, walking all over the place, claiming, proclaiming, if they, they know the law, they should now face us in the law. This is the majority leader speaking. Because, because you are earlier in your statement, you have indicated that, yes, so with that business, we said until the matter, until the matter is determined, we are not going to go to parliament, and that will abide by the ruling of the court. Today, the court has determined the matter, and has ordered the parties to file the necessary processes for the final determination of the matter. That is it. So we expect our colleagues and all those involved in this matter to respect the law, including the right honorable speaker. We don't have any personal qualms with anybody. Ours is the law. But then let me quickly uh, repeat this to party members, to MPP full soldiers, to MPP parliamentary candidates, to MPP executives. Let's go all out to work hard. President Akufado has done a yeoman's job. Of course, we don't have a perfect government, but we have elections to win. If we go all out and win and win massively, this NDC behavior will be a thing of the past. If you look at Central Region, we won 19 seats. And parliamentary seat, we won only 10. This is not a time to say you don't like a friend, somebody is, is upsetting you, and you vote skirt and blouse. We don't need skirt and blouse. We need Baumia with all the parliamentary candidates yeah, 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 across yeah, yeah. the 275 yeah, yeah. constituencies. Yeah, yeah. So please work hard. Let's finish hard and let's win and put these NDC guys to...